टू वर्ल्ड गेस्ट जोर्स टूडे टॉपिक इज अबाउट टेन शॉकिंग और अमेजिंग बर्ड बिहेवियर्स एज वी आर फेमिलियर विद मेनी बर्ड बिहेवियर्स एंड लाइफ स्टाइल सच एस माइग्रेशन फॉरेजिंग स्ट्रैटेजीज एंड नेस्टिंग हाउ एवर बर्ड्स आर अमॉन्ग द मोस्ट मिस्टीरियस highly evolved and yet primitive life forms on the planet there are some with behaviors and abilities so bizarre shocking horrible or even human like that we will be astounded or disturbed as we realize how little we know about the evolved dinosaurs known as birds number 1 is bat killing chickadees chickadees are diminutive yet intelligent garden songbirds smaller than a sparrow with a cheerful innocent appearance however one would be advised to reconsider these tiny birds european great tits have been observed entering hollow trees and bulging roasting bats to death before dragging them out to eat the bats had their heads pegged open and were mostly targeted during the winter months according to the europe max planck institute of ornithology europe's keyboard research center This extreme predatory behavior is nothing short of incredible for a tiny colorful European garden songbird proving that many weird and creepy mysteries may be hidden behind the appearance of any apparently innocent little songbird. Number 2 is whale hunting gulls. We normally think of seagulls as coastal birds that eat fish and at times may be a minor nuisance. or a fascination to birders who take great pleasure in sorting out obscure gull species of Argentina however gulls are more than living up to the scary depiction in Alfred Hitchcock's movie the birds by targeting much larger than the herring giant right whales that measure out 50 feet in length are being repeatedly targeted by increasing populations of kelp gull a massive fish eating species with ominous dark plumage as the whale surface the gulls have learned to swoop down and shear large pieces of flesh and blubber out the whales in a horror movie film like scene you may garbage disposal has been blamed for the population expansion but cannot fully explain the terrifying actions number 3 is running away from home It's a good thing storks do not bring us our babies after all or they might be instructed to run to social assistance if they didn't like the dinner offered. In a carefully researched study, scientists in Spain discovered that around 40% of European white stork nestlings abandoned their parents partway through development and promptly snuck into a neighboring stork family's nest. The motivation checks that were not completely satisfied with the parents hunting skills were running away from home in hopes of finding a better meal with the neighborhoods the grass is always greener on the other side number 4 is lock up the family indian hornbills are the old world evolutionary equivalents of tuckens and resemble a cross between a woodpecker and the previously mentioned stork While many female birds contribute substantially to the construction of a nest, these giant forest birds receive a little help from the male. After locating a suitable nest cavity, the female is sealed in by the male, who builds a barrier of mud, bird droppings and sticks. Only the bill of the female and the young can reach to receive the frogs, mice and food brought by the male. This bizarre imprisonment lasts until the brood is ready to fledge and is thought to provide protection against nest predators. It also prevents the female from mating with other males. Number 5 is punk rocker. The bizarre palm cockatoo is a denizen of the Australian and New Guinean rainforest that looks for all the world like a punk rocker with its striking plumage. and outrageous mohawk head feathers this gene parrot is not just playing the part it's the king of avian rock music when a male palm cockatoo seeks a mate he shears off a sizable branch with his massive hawk bill capable of shattering a broom handle and then 
flies to a hollow nest tree. Holding his manufactured drumstick in his foot, the avian rock star beats the stick against the tree trunk, giving an, giving an impressive percussion performance and looking like he is auditioning for a position with the misfits. The female soon arrives if she likes what she hears. His mass bird crashes. Yatinga is a village located on an Indian plateau next to sizable cliffs. The town has become notorious among travel sources due to the frequent mass accidents when numbers of Asian birds, including tiger herons, pitters, hawks, and egrets, crash into the ground in a dramatically confused state. The mass impacts leave the birds that survive impact highly vulnerable to all manners of dangers and as a result, many exotic bird species were being mercilessly harvested. Although the cause of the bizarre phenomenon has never been fully determined, conservationists led by the famous naturalist EPG and Indian bird ornithologist Salim Ali initiated an expedition that resulted in many villagers being taught to help the downed birds. When is house wren sabotage? House wrens are the stereotypical little brown bird in appearance. However, these four inch long residents of North American woodlots and gardens are in fact saboiters with truly industrial capacity. Feeding mostly on insects, house wrens are constantly hunting, defending territory, and destroying other birds' nests. Many male birds will chase away males of this species, but in the nesting season, Male house wrens become hellbent on not only chasing away but in fact eradicating entire families of other birds. Sneaking up to a bluebird, finch or swallow nest, the evil house wren male pierces the eggs and then proceeds to trash the nest site. He will do this to any nest he can, all that while establishing several of his own nests, each with its own female. Number 8 is Mild High Club. Bird reproduction is both defined by egg laying and being just subject to many jokes, whereas most birds do the deed in a hallowed oak tree on a branch or out in the case of gulls in public on a sandbar, swallow like relatives of whippoor wills and hummingbirds known as swifts are dedicated members of the Mild High Club. Lacking effective perching skills, Swifts have mastered the air to the point where they can fly across a continent in three days, slip on the wing and yes, copulate. Swifts simply do not stop for sex and after its spectacular 200 mile per hour display flight, the male and female swift rush together and complete the act belly to belly at an altitude of over 2000 feet and faster than any small aircraft and is red breasted natach traps red breasted nataches are weird birds to begin with native to canada's boreal woodlands and pacific rainforests these strange creatures have hawk claws and bent necks allowing them to walk headfirst down a tree trunk poking for insects and centipedes nesting in a tree the bird doesn't want any of this potentially venomous creatures invading its nets. Therefore, the Natach painstakingly installs a ring of thick, toxic coniferesin around the edge of its nest, where it traps and kills any predator or pest that comes near to it. To avoid getting caught in its own bobby trap, Nataches are known to fly straight into the nest without stopping as they apparently prefer to risk a crash than get captured by the pitch. Number 10 is Venus Flytrap Bird. Towny frogmouths are a bizarre Australian bird that inhabits eucalyptus woodlands where prey is abundant. Frogmouths resemble owls but are in fact giant, awesome and rather creepy relatives of the swifts previously mentioned. Frogmouths do not actively hunt but rather they stand upright in a tree, perfectly resembling an old branch. When a small bird, frog, lizard or dragonfly approaches, the enormous gapping mouth expands open, 
quickly drowning in the hapless animal. Within a fraction of a second, the massive bill snapshots with a loud click that can be heard 100 meters away. The prey is then forced back and swallowed whole. Downy frog mouths do not actually do anything except